Thank you very much, chaps. Yes, there's a very international feel to this one. 33-year-old Thibaut Tricol. <coughs> Up against 32-year-old Jesus Nogueira. This completes our second cycle of matches. And we'll start to have a look at the table at the conclusion of this one to see how that's taking shape. But so far today, Coles had a 4-1 win over Martin Adams with a 95-53. And Jesus went down 4-2 to, to Roy first. Thornton Game with on. a 91-42. This feels... Like it could be a bit of a thriller. 100. Steady away from Tebow with a ton. Getting your steps in, Matt. Yeah, and just 45. trying to watch it on the screen as I was coming through. Don't want to miss a second of this one because for me, Tebow's the last player standing who doesn't have question marks over them after the first couple of games. 180. Confirmed. <laughs> Something we picked up. 93. Picked up on. He's played a lot of darts in the Super Series or then Live League. And he traditionally has an indifferent Monday. 60. Finds a bit of form Tuesday and tends to be in full flow by Wednesday. Well, if he's playing like this on Monday, I agree with you, Matt. 85. Tebow, <coughs> you require 161. But the uh, players will be on notice. Of course, he's played a lot of darts recently at a high level, and that's got to be giving him an advantage. He's not coming in cold, per se. 60. Tebo, you require 60. Personally, I think this comes down to a little bit of preparation. 50. Because we've spoke about Tebo before in the past and how he comes late at night. And he's well, he usually flies in and the, the last flight in, doesn't he? And then travels across country to get here, often arriving around about 5 a.m. Tebo, you require well, 10. Well, actually, he's been playing in the Pro Tour on the 4th and the 5th of November, which means the likelihood is he didn't go home to come no back. No score. He stayed over here, Hazel which should means require 78. he's not coming in late, he's not tired, he's ready, he's rested, and he's getting dividends already early on. 38. Wait, he's rested and well practiced. Tebow, you require 10. At a high level. Who's just a split this time? Level two. Game shot on the Different first result. Tebow This Trico. time he gets over the line and gets a leg. And you say, well rested and well practiced. He's had two averages in the mid-90s. Second leg, it's Hazus to throw first. One against Nathan Gerbin. Game on. And one in victory over Daryl Gurney. That was in the second round of the Players' Championship 29. But he opened up Players' Championship 29 with a 6-3 win over Germany's Max Hopp. With 103.36. And again, doing that sort of thing is just confirmation. That's, that's all we crave as players. Even sometimes in defeat. You know, if you've just missed the odd double year in there and you've played against someone who's really produced, you can break your own numbers down and you take a, a lot of confidence from, from seeing figures like that and getting wins over players like Max Hopp, but more so Daryl Gurney. 140. Still a, a top, top player looking like he's going back in the right direction. Back to back. 140s for Tricol on the Nagara throw. 85. Hazel should require 170. We're still down to 136 after nine. And this is just another example. Oh, ball for the 170. 
Game shot on the second leg. Fantastic finish there Jesus from Jesus Nogueira. He took out the 102 in the opening, but that one is the biggest finish that we will see Third this week. We might see it match, but we cannot Game see on. it bettered because that is the biggest finish on a dartboard. 170 finish from Jesus. And that 96. gives me more confirmation he comes from a soft tip background because he found that ball with ease. Yeah, I was just about to say beforehand that losing the lie where it shows an extra treble needed was never more prominent than there. 50 with 140, 140 to leave the 2 2 1. 85 is 136. That is now a two treble combination shot. If you just stayed straight, the 1 2 1. You've been a one treble shot. And you get two bites of the cherry at it, of course. So, as a professional dart player, or someone who's looking to be a professional dart player, the first thing you need to do is stay straight. Because any time you 81. lose that line, it forces you into an extra treble. And don't be too stubborn. stubborn. One hundred and thirty-four. Other options available. In that opening game for Jesus against Robert Thornton, despite the 96. defeat, that we saw enough in there to suggest he's going to be a danger and a threat. Absolutely. Well, 131. It. it was a 12 darter with the 170 in leg two for Jesus. Tebow in leg three is left tops after 12. Fifty-seven. Up to our Tebow, you require forty. Fifty-seven. 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 Fif
but I'm not going to let it happen. If he wins this game, he is not going under the radar. I'm not going to allow it. He averaged 91 in his opening game. He's averaged 94 PPH. in this one with a 170 finish. I like the look of him. I think I was on my holidays 85. when he played last time. It's my first real look at him live. I like what I'm seeing. One hundred. I haven't quite worked it out yet, but if I was to just be hypercritical, one hundred. I would just not like you, mate. <laughs> I would just say that the darts seem to land at slightly different angles. One hundred. As we can see with M three, Tebow, you require yeah. one hundred and thirty three. And that's just a minuscule timing issue, isn't it? Ninety-three. He's up top. Hazel should require one hundred and eight. Uh, one hundred and two in defeat against Thornton. He's already had a one seventy. Can he find tops? Eighty-eight. One dart for a break of throw and a three-two lead. 40. An intriguing route because going that way you'd suggest that he's looking at the Shangas on the 18s. Game shot on the fifth leg. Sebo Trico. And then was he worried about the angle of the dart maybe just carrying it into the possibly the treble? Was he good at left top? Game on. 108. Are you uh, a 57 19 32 man? Yeah, I'm on the 19s. I'm one of the uh. Like you get these stubborn players that are always looking to leave tops. I'm the same for the 96. 16. So the whole breakdown for me is all to try and leave me in that area. I've started to go the 19s way, but it's it's hard to 140. break old habits. So I'm trouble 20 or trouble 18. Ninety three. I do like the the nineteens route. I like that adjustment, the smaller adjustment across. One hundred and twenty five. Use a play on the word game and match. We've seen some good games today, but this is by far the best match so far. And by match, I mean two people that are playing a similar standard. That comes down to who misses or takes an opportunity. Agreed. 140. Hazel should require 167. The scoring phase, but since then, Jesus has hit a, a lot of 140 plus shots. Really ticking 94. that power scoring column. Tebow, you require 96. Regardless of that, Tebow is 96 points away after just nine darts on the match. This could be an 11. Game, shots, and, and that match. was Tebow a quality Trico. match. As Charlie just called that one in there. Really good, tight game. Both players in the mid-90s. 94 for Tebow, 96 for Jesus. Jesus with that incredible 170 finish to hold his throw earlier on. And when we look at the average of Tracol, and then we look at that checkout percentage of just 26, that could have been even bigger. Tebow Tracol is the guy to watch at the moment. That is four points on the board. A 4-1 victory earlier against Adams. A 4-2 against Jesus. And coming up next, we've got Matt Jackson, who's looking to get his first points on the board against Robert Thornton.